Rebel Nation, the Ole Miss soccer season kicks off this Friday night, August 18th here in Oxford, welcoming Alabama State to town. The Rebels coming off of a nine-win season a year ago, but looking to bounce back and make another deep run in the NCAA tournament, just two years removed from a Sweet 16 appearance, the first in program history. What has head coach Matt Mott and the Rebels excited this year is the potential for a high goal total. Returning strikers like Gabby Little and CeCe Kaiser, who has tallied 19 goals in her Ole Miss career. CeCe's just class, and she's, uh, you know, into her junior year, is so um, comfortable on the ball and, and settled into that forward spot really great for us. I kind of joke that I think CeCe, Gabby, and Channing are like the big three up there. It's unstoppable. I think when I'm playing sometimes, it's just so easy to play a ball to them and let them do their thing. They're just they're awesome, and they're little firecrackers in there. <laughs> Moving towards the midfield and defense, the Rebels will rely on veteran leadership from Captain Bella Fiorenzo, senior Courtney Carroll, and three-year starter on the back line, Liza Harbin. But it'll be the new faces that will make an impact on the defensive line. Yeah, Liza, I've been with since day one, and Liza, she knows the system, she knows what we're supposed to do. Her and I work really well together. Um, we've brought in some fresh faces, especially in the center back position with Ella and Grace, and some of the freshmen also play center back. So that's been an interesting adjustment, but they're learning, they're listening, and they're very willing uh, and able to, be, to want to be successful. Really all of them are doing great, pushing the limits, making us better. I love their work rate and effort, and they're just continuing to raise the level for us. Sophomore Claire Williams will get the nod in goal to start the year due to a red card that Marnie Merritt received in her final game of the last season. But once that suspension ends, Merritt will return, hoping to have another successful year in goal. Both their fitness levels were excellent, so they've come back and, and really battling. And, and um, you know, Marnie's setting the tone as, as a, one of our leaders on the team and, and uh, on the field when we're playing and all those kind of things. They're so great to have behind us, and I have the utmost confidence in them that both of them will um, compete and do their best when they get in there and come with a good attitude. This team has some of the best potential I think I've seen since I've been here, so I am just ecstatic. <laughs> After the Rebels face Alabama State on Friday night, they face Northwestern State on Sunday. Both games slated for 7 p.m. We hope that we'll see you here at the Ole Miss soccer fields.